Did you know you can create your own comic strips with Canva? In this video, I'm going to show you how to design your comic layout with Canva's tools, how to customize the characters, text, and images of your comic, and how to save and share your finished comic from Canva. So let's get started. To begin, we need to go to the searching bar of Canva, and on here we have to type for comic strip. So I'm just going to type for it strip which is going to click in this option here we can see some templates that canva offer to us we need to decide whether to choose a free template or if you have canva pro you can get the canva pro templates so i'm just going to be choosing one from these options so i'm just going to be choosing this one on here and i'm going to click in customize this template now our template is going to be divided into four parts the format of the page that is the first one the different characters the different expressions for our characters and the text box for our characters and on here we can see some final result so now on here we can start to play with the designing of our comic strip so I can start to add more characters, let's say, so I can go and choose the one that I want to add. So I'm going to be choosing this one and I'm just going to click on duplicate. And I'm going to pull it all the way to the first page. On here, I can add it in my next page. But as you can see here, it's only the characters without the expressions. So from here, I can also grab one different expression. So, because it's a dog, I'm just going to be adding this one. And I'm going to make the same duplicate and I'm going to pull it on here. And I can add this expression to my dog. So, on there. So, we already have our second one. And let's say that I want to change the expression of this one. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to go and click over it. And I'm going to click in on group. And now I can change the face of my character. So let's say that I don't like this one. I'm going to delete it. And I can pull one from here also. So let's say I want to add this one on here. And I can adjust it to my character. All the way. To adjust it. So let's say that I cannot really see from here. I can go and get closer to leave it more detailed so there we go i already have my other character but let's imagine that we want to add another element that it's not in these pages what we can do is we can go to the section of elements and on here we can search for more elements that can fit into our comic so let's say so I'm just going to be searching for dog food and I'm going to go to the section of graphics. And here we can start to add something like this. And then just pull it all the way to here. So we can add it like an extra element of our characters. Or we can keep looking for more options. Also maybe this one works well. I think it costs more with the type of comic that we're creating on here. So I can add it on here. So we have already our food for our dog. And we can keep pulling much more elements that we need that are not in these pages. And let's say that I also want to change the colors of my comic. To do this, we can click directly in the shape and we can click in this color on here. And now we can change the color of our shape. But if you don't want to be playing around with all the colors, you can go to the section of design on here. And we can go on this section of styles. And then in this section, you can get some combinations of colors that can work for your comic strip. So let's say we can add this one, this one, something like this also works. 
I would recommend you to do this at the end of your comic strip so all the colors of all your uh, elements are going to be matching because now if we add another one let's say this one it's gonna it's gonna be in a different color so it's not gonna be as same as this ones and let's say to add our text in our text box what we can do is we're just gonna go to the section of text and you can click in a uh, subheader and then you can start to add your text in these little boxes once we are done with the creation of our strip we can proceed to share it or download it to download our strip we have to go to the white rectangle on the corner that says share we're going to click on it and on here we're going to click again in download just you can keep it as a PNG or in case that you want to print it, you can have to keep it as a PDF to print. That is this one on here. And you can download it and you can print your comic strip. And that's it. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more content. Thank you for watching and see you in another video. And that's it. If you like this video,